Location, location, location. Hi, welcome to the third episode of The Photographer's Take. Today we're talking about location. Uh, location for what exactly? Where you have your ceremony is key to the outcome of your video, to your pictures. Mind you, photographers are not magicians. Even though we do magic with the camera, there are places where some people might find not to be nice. A photographer's eye will see it differently. So yes, somehow we create some magic with the environment we have. But then, we are not magicians. So, when you choose to have a wedding or a traditional marriage, if it's within your power, find a location that looks pleasant. You know, for example, you're doing some makeup and we're being put into a room where it's a bedroom for probably within the family house. And unfortunately, by the time you get there as a photographer, you realize that the, the direction of the room doesn't help. Sometimes you have, you know, dresses and bags and things like that packed behind a bride. You know, this is not the time they're going to tell them to pack the things out, but uh, this is to future clients or anybody getting married. Now, when, you, when you choose to, you know, get married, think about your location. Church, well, you can't do anything about the church if you're getting married in church, but then reception area is key. Um, traditional marriage location is key. If there's a family member who has a very nice house that you think can be used, why not? But then if you have no option than to use what is available, well, photographers will do their best. But mind you, and get to know that if you have the chance to pick a location, that would help the process, especially during makeup. Because with those ones, you have the option of picking the room of your choice. If you pick a room which is even still within the family house, try and make sure that you set the place up nicely. Um, things that are not supposed to be in the room are removed so that at least the background will be pleasant. Let your decorator do something nice. It could be balloons or it could be some flowers arranged in the background. That would add some pleasing sense to, to the environment. If not, if it's flat and it's a green, all green wall or all blue wall, you realize that these these colors are not very pleasant in you know when when you're shooting so if it's possible for your decorator to do something little in the background too why not it will be nice but always think about it that location has a great influence on the outcome of your images and video thank you for watching